Fame Expo haul. This is a little bracelet. I had to cut it off because it was really itching. And they give it to you right upon entry. If you watched my vlog, I have a couple bags. It's not as much stuff as it seems. It's more like a bunch of bags that they give you. Let's talk about this a Lime Crime liquid lipstick I got. I'm wearing it right now. Uh, I'm 100% sure that it matches with this whole look. I liked it because it was like a watermelon color or like after you eat hot Cheetos, your lips are like this color. I don't know, I like it. I don't own a color like this. I was actually gonna buy like a burgundy red color and I was like, okay, I have enough of those. But this color, it's like not burgundy, but it's almost like a red color, but it's not red. That doesn't even make sense, but. And I love the packaging. I love that the glass is matte and the little roses on the top. This lippy was $16 plus tax. It comes out to like $17.50. I'll let you guys know if I love it. So I got the Jaclyn Hill palette at the Morphe station. And guess what? It was not discounted at all, but whatever. Cause I was gonna buy it anyway. But here it is. So if you guys want me to do some tutorials with this eyeshadow palette, let me know. I am ready to play with it. Honestly, yeah, I'm upset that there was no discount, but they said there was no, okay. Why does this look like it's swatched? Morphe actually gave me a free gel liner. I am excited to try it out. I currently own the BH Cosmetics ones, and unfortunately, I'm not a fan of it, even though I love BH Cosmetics products, because it's not matte. It's very greasy and patchy, so if you were to do a smoky eye with it, which I've tried several times already, it's like patchy and it moves all around. It doesn't stay in place. So I heard the Inglot Black Gel Liner is really good, but I have yet to find it somewhere. But for now, I will be trying this Morphe Black Gel Liner that's called Slate. So this is Alka Glam. There are some companies that if you walk by, they'll be like, hey, if you take a picture or if you follow us, we'll give you something free so they gave me this oil it is a vitamin c serum it's small it's a sample obviously this mask is from millennial beauty it's called glow away they have a i think a mint no aloe scent aloe scent and a chocolate scent this actually has glitter on it i do want to do a video reviewing if i like it I love doing face masks and making sure my skin is flawless. They also give you a free little pin. I actually could have signed in, not signed up, signed up for their vanity free giveaway. I totally forgot about it um, since I already have a vanity mirror. <laughs> but they do have giveaways at some booths. So if you buy two, you get them for $20 each versus buying one for 25 so Jazz got the other one. This Ben Nye powder, I wanted to add it to my freelancing kit because I've heard really good things about this banana powder. It was, I think, $13, I'm not 100% sure, but I'm so happy that I have it. They have about different sizes, one smaller than this one, I think. And this is a medium, and then they have like more of a bigger bottle for the large size, and obviously they're priced differently, but I didn't really look into that <laughs> at that same booth they had these stila glitters which are usually 22 dollars they had it for 13 dollars you guys and uh the girl had the swatches in her hand and of course i wanted all of them but i only went with the one that i was most intrigued by which was this one i've seen them they're so pretty i'm gonna swatch it on my hand so you guys can see it this one is the shade Rose Gold Retro, and you guys can see it hopefully on my head. No, you can't. I went to Lily Lashes. I went when it was empty, not before Lily actually went. So I got these two pair of Lily Lashes. This one is Goddess. Usually it retails for, I believe, $20. Let me take it out of the package. And it was at $15. This is one of the only places that didn't charge me tax. Hopefully you guys see them. 
maybe the light is too bright i'm not even 100 percent sure about these lashes i might give them away because i think i like mine more dramatic so look out for that giveaway that's coming these oh my god guess what lashes are these they're the miami ones everyone uses these i think uh the girl said that kim wore them to the Met gala i'm not very fond of kim right now so these are usually 30 bucks and they were 25 bucks like i said no taxes thank god this was 35 dollars for this baggie and you know individual beauty blenders are about 20 dollars each and so there is one two 30 40 bucks and there's a black small one in here and a gray one plus a mini soap um i didn't care much for the soap honestly i just use my sote soap but i thought that the beauty blender was a whole deal because my beauty blender needs to get replaced look at this it's missing a piece i always wash it a lot and it's time to get a new one this one we have a black one we'll just put them like this then we have a mini soap maybe i'll save it for when i travel it's two mini blenders this one's smaller than this one and so yeah i think it was a total great buy like i got so much stuff for just 35 dollars let me compare them to the real techniques ones so this is beauty blender this is real techniques so this one's bigger and softer and this one is the smaller one so this one's bigger than this one That was this. Got it at the Naomi section at the expo. There was this other brand that is called Stelazi, which if you follow them, they were giving away free eyeshadows. So I got these two. And then last but not least, I got this Saint Marcel VIP bag because I was one of the first 15 people that were in line to see Carla, the real Carla J. And so I haven't opened anything in here because I really wanted to see it and give you guys a first impression as far as what it is. The packaging is already so beautiful. This is a velvet finish here. I've never actually tried any of their products, so I'm pretty excited to see what's in here. But you could tell it's quality product just by the packaging. So this is the highlighting palette. Oh my god! Okay, so there's six different highlighters. Soleil. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it. S-O-L-E-I-L. Soleil Creme. Tres Chic. Dior. Amour. And voila. So these are more pinky toned. And these are more curly toned. And then there's this one. Super excited to use these highlighters and check them out. Next, we have, again, beautiful packaging from Saint Marcel. I literally want to just keep these packages because they're so nice. And this is a mascara. Oh. It's so thick and pretty. Like me. Hmm, just kidding. You guys can kind of see the wand shape. I love the wand shape. It gets the little hairs, the long hairs and the short hairs. And this is a liquid lipstick. This shade is called Rogue. <gasps> oh my god. Do you see how beautiful this red is? Yes. This was a good VIP package. Okay guys, so that was it for my haul. I only spent $200. By only, I mean, I, because I thought I was gonna spend more. I think that was a good 
amount to spend based on everything I got. I got really good offers, except for the Jacqueline Hill palette that wasn't on discount. But everything else, I'm so happy with. I'm excited to use, especially the VIP package. Um, so let me know what products you guys want me to use in my next tutorial. If there's any ones that stood out to you that you really want me to try out. And as far as this liquid lipstick, I like the color and everything for the liquid lipstick. Uh, but I do feel like it's drying. It is matte, so it's gonna be drying. I'm gonna give it a, a 9 out of 10, just because it feels dry. I'm comparing it to Kat Von D. When I put on the Kat Von D one, it's one of the only ones that doesn't dry me out when I'm wearing a matte lipstick. So that's what I'm basing it off of. But honestly, I like it. I think I probably will be buying more from their brand, so... That is my thought on it. This color is bomb. Rustic, like I said, if you are interested in it. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. Again, let me know what you guys want me to use. And thanks for watching. Tell me what you hear. I'm always gonna listen. I'm always gonna listen.